Anyone who mentions it should shut up. And not just shut up, be shut up by force if necessary, with jail time. Now we're gonna do something we almost never do. We're gonna play you a clip from The View, which is now calling for a Department of Justice investigation into this show and Tulsi Gabbard. Watch. What Tucker Carlson parrots every night on Fox News, what Tulsi Gabbard is spreading, is actually helping Putin get away with criminal acts against innocent Ukrainian civilians. And I think DOJ, in the same way that it is uh, setting up a task force to investigate oligarchs, should look into people who are Russian propagandists and shilling for Putin. That's being, if you are a foreign asset. Uh, now, this woman keeps looking down. Now, now this is, this. You, if you want to see Vin at his peak tinfoilism, okay? T peak tinfoil Vin. Why this woman keeps looking down as if she's reading from a script. Listen closely to what this woman is saying because it will blow your mind. And I think DOJ, in the same way that it is uh, setting up a task force to investigate oligarchs, should look into people who are Russian propagandists and shilling for Putin. That's being, if you are a foreign asset uh, to a dictator, mm -hmm. it should be investigated. In fact, I remember look at this when shit. Tulsi Gabbard, mm -hmm. and I even hate that we're discussing it because I think to myself, who is this woman? How do you not call out something that is repeating mm -hmm. false Russian propaganda well, that has been brought down? I, they used the DOJ. That's the Department of Justice. Uh, guys, guys. Okay, now aside from my 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 crazy tinfoil hat conspiracy theory, um, listen to what the the essence of what she the Department of Justice should be brought in against Tucker Carlson and and Tulsi Gabbard. Huh? But, but I thought Putin was the crazy one for, for locking up dissenting speech. Wasn't Putin, did, aren't you guys all telling me that Putin's, a, this was, why is she on national television on one of the most viewed, pun intended, shows in our country calling for the Department of Justice to stand up a special whatever to go after people like Tucker and Tulsi? Huh? They used to arrest people for doing stuff like this. Holy shit! <laughs> yes! Whoopi! <laughs> Whoopi's back from her suspension, I see. Guys! Guys! Yes! We used to arrest people for this! It was called McCarthyism, and it used to be universally looked upon as a dark period of American history where a lot of innocent lives were ruined. Holy shit! On, on national TV, we used to arrest people like this. What? That, okay, so, so that, that segment I'm assuming is on YouTube. Is YouTube gonna take that down? for promoting McCarthyism? Does that violate YouTube's program guidelines? Is that is that violational content? Promoting McCarthyism? We used to arrest, I cannot believe how naked these people are with their fascist McCarthyist bullshit. It's unbelievable to me. <sighs> It is unbelievable to me. They used to arrest people like this. Really? They used to arrest people for saying stuff like this. Hmm, when did they arrest people for saying stuff like this? And who is they exactly? <laughs> well, the former Karen Elaine Johnson didn't tell us. She kept it vague because that way it's a lot more threatening and maybe you will shut up. And again, we hesitate to show clips from that show. It's an IQ killer. We're making an exception tonight because the view is not alone. A lot of people sound like this. And it, it, it's one of these processes where it sounds insane. We for sure, I can't believe they said that. I, I, I'm blown away. I, 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 I gotta tell you, dear listener, I am blown away. Th th this woman just promoted McCarthyism. 
The other woman is asking for the DOJ to shut people down. So I don't want to hear anything about how crazy Putin is. None of us live in Russia if you live in America. If you live in America, none of us live in Russia. You live in America and you got people comfortable enough on mainstream media on one of the most popular shows on the planet Earth with the biggest reach possible to influence the zeitgeist into supporting and resurrecting McCarthyism. And simultaneous to that, YouTube is telling us we're going to shut down contrary voices. So the only voices in this utopia or dystopia, depending on what side of the meta narrative you're on, the only voices that will be heard will be this bullshit. And you don't you don't see that as mind control? This is not mind control to you? This is what I'm telling you. These people are a lot more sophisticated than Putin who will send his stormtroopers to beat the hell out of you and shove you in a van and, and lock you up. They don't need to do that. They need to say this. They got this this unassuming lady in her little pink little whatever blouse, whatever. And they got they write the script for her and she feeds you that bullshit. And they made sure to put it in the mouth of a person of color. So if you criticize her, you're a racist. And then they'll deplatform you for racism. You see how that works? <sighs> Holy shit. And then over time, what sounded crazy the first time you heard it sounds a little more normal. And then three weeks into the war, Correct. it sounds like probably pretty necessary. Correct. Keith Ober. This is unthinkable. It's unthinkable. I don't know why everybody, how, how is any, how was this not broadcast all over the fucking America, uh, 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 American show, popular American shows, uh, uh advocate for resurrecting a new mccarthyism this should have been headline news is always at the cutting edge of things like this he was watching the view today doesn't have a lot else to do and he responded to that segment by writing this on twitter they us are russian assets and there is a war there's a case for detaining them militarily Trials are a sign of good faith and patience on the part of democracy. There it is! <laughs> so we're at war with Russia. There we it must is. send you to the gulag because freedom. <laughs> oh my God. I'm done. I'm done. Show's over. Show's over. I, I really am done, guys. I really am. I'm out of here. There is a case. Uh, uh, for solving this militarily, we're at war. There's a case for dealing with this militarily. Tucker Carlson and Tulsi Gabbard should be dealt with militarily.